This is Marcy with your Moon Phases and Visible Planet Alignments for December 2025. The full cold moon lights up the sky all night overnight on December 4th. It's also a supermoon. In fact, it's the third of four supermoons in a row. It won't look any bigger to your eye, but it will look brighter. It'll be floating among three of our brightest stars, Capella, Aldebaran, and Betelgeuse. And it'll be a spectacular sight with Jupiter near the twin stars of Gemini and Orion near Sirius, the brightest star in the sky. Plus, the supermoon coincides with the moon being closest to Earth this month, so people living along the coast can expect high tides around the day of the full moon. The December full moon is called the cold moon due to the frigid temperatures of winter. It's also known as the long night moon because it occurs near the winter solstice, the longest night of the year. The last quarter moon is on December 11th. Last quarter moons rise around midnight and set at noon. Can you spot it high in the sky after sunrise? And the moon is also farthest from Earth on December 17th. The December solstice falls on the 21st. Winter arrives in the northern hemisphere and summer begins in the southern hemisphere. We'll have the darkest skies for stargazing on the nights around the new moon on December 20th. Plus, this is the third of three new micromoons or most distant new moons in 2025. The first quarter moon falls on December 27th. First quarter moons rise around noon and set at midnight. Look for it high overhead as darkness falls. The Geminid meteor shower will be best overnight on December 13 through 14. You might see over 100 meteors per hour in a dark sky. The bright planet Jupiter is nearby. A second meteor shower, the Ursids, occurs under dark skies before dawn on December 22nd. You might see 5 to 10 meteors per hour. As for planets, you can see two planets in the morning sky in December. You'll find bright Jupiter high in the western sky and elusive Mercury low on the eastern horizon shortly before sunrise. Mercury slips away by the last week of the month. As for the evening sky, Saturn is visible until after midnight and Jupiter is rising after sunset and will be visible through dawn. The moon visits Jupiter on December 6th and 7th. The twin stars of Gemini, Pollux and Castor are nearby. The moon floats near Mercury shortly before sunrise on the morning of December 17th. The brightest star of Libra is higher in the sky. And the moon joins Saturn on December 26th. I hope you enjoy stargazing as much as I do. Until next time, one Earth, one Sky, Earth Sky.